own your skills. But what you in the danger room? Yeah, you in the danger room. Come on now. <laughs> it's like a dream. Everything moving fast, but you moving slow. Change the tempo. Watch we on time. Hey, now you know. Listen to the rhythm we giving them. We bringing it with passion. Smashing. You should just move to my groove. Case in point. Watch how I Okay, so for this build is probably the craziest shit I've done. Bear with me though, he is not um, super high level yet. I would like to have a level 90 or something like that. Maybe a little more. The resistances are absolutely ass right now, but it doesn't really matter. Yeah, so I got 41 points into strength and got 66 points into dexterity and 378 into vitality. Basically, there's nothing into to energy, just a base of 25. And let's take a little bit of a look. So this is strictly for doing Ubers and nothing else basically this is just to run through them like it's nothing um for the inventory it's i have to wear these skillers and it's like all skillers the whole way through all the way to the last one um this one i don't have to wear a skiller here to hit the the 37 skill so uh, for that reason i went with a faster hit recovery and all rest yeah. And then we got an all rest on this one as well. And on this, we got a torch. And Annie. A couple more rest counts. Um, mostly lightning. All rest. And uh, I think one fire. Yeah. And I'm wearing a pair of two 2010 gloves with some lightning rest on them that I crafted. And. I am using dual Raven Frost, using a T-God, some Optical Riders, and a Storm Shield with a 15 increased attack speed dual in it. At Matt Scarab, which I'm thinking about changing, but I'm not entirely sure yet. And a G Face and Enigma. The G face has an um in it, the auras, just to top it off a little bit. A last wish and a CTA on the swap with a spirit shield, which is also how I will be teleporting around when I teleport. Um, and for the skills, I have nothing into traps at all. I put enough points, I maxed out uh, Shadow Master and Venom, and I put I'm putting points into Mind Blast and Burst of Speed, the rest of the points that I get. I'm just going to split it roughly evenly between those two. And other than that, it's basically just all in Dragon Talon. I have one point into each of these. But, uh, yeah. We take a at, uh, 
be wearing the right gear for that part. <laughs> okay, so we have 40, 43% damage reduction. And 35 increased attack speed. The burst of speed and fanaticism. That's it. Doesn't seem like a lot, but it becomes a lot real fast. 75 to faster run walk. And 122 to crushing blow. That's just crazy to me. <laughs> 120. And yeah, that's uh, that's the build. And I do have a couple of things in here for pre-buffing. For instance, I have a demon limb. I'll put that on real quick. Uh, it goes off every time. There we go. And now if we look at my attack, and up a whole lot to 18,000. <laughs> and I'll put on Venom, of course. I'll do... I'll go bow real quick and put my Shadow Master on. Actually, I'll put Venom and Shadow Master and all that stuff on. Back in here when I bow. There we go. Then Venom, Shadow Master. We'll bow to Shadow Master as well. There we go. Burst of speed while I'm holding the CTA because it gives me plus two skills. Go. And that's about it. Now I'm basically ready to go in and, and do the Ubers. So I also have a Stormlass in here that I sometimes swap out for if I'm doing Chaos Runs and Fail Runs and using Last Wish is not necessarily the best thing. And using this is, just gives you more of a AoE damage. I have a Sentry Sanctuary in the in the stash. I do need to re-roll this into a 70 all rest. But that's if I again if I do chaos runs and stuff like that I want more resistance. Um I do have a pair of sand strikes. I don't know why I have those. I have the old pair of rag gloves I used to use and then another pair I crafted uh, two twenty ten with some life on it. Yeah, and um, the plan for the future here is getting a Mage Blade Enigma so I can save a little more strength instead of using this Dust Ram. So that would be one upgrade for her. And then, yeah, that's, that's about it. I have some other stuff in here that is like play around stuff that I haven't really decided if I wanted to use or not. And a couple of like random items that I picked up on around when I was playing. I do have this metal grid which I've been thinking about switching out and then doing an iron golem maybe. Uh, but again, I'm not entirely sure if I want to stay with the admin or if I want to go high lords, if I want to go with. Metal grid, or, you know, or maybe something completely different, like a crafted. I was thinking about that too. Um, for the cast to to teleport faster. Preferably, that would be a fifteen or, or a twenty, right? That that would be a preferred time. You ready? Oh uh, yeah. That's great timing. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. This is impeccable timing right there. I was literally, I literally just got done talking about what the gear on the assassin was. So I'm gonna make a video on it. Dude, that little 
Be buff. I'm gonna jump in matrons then, I'm gonna just wait here for you. End of the portal. I have fate as a as an attack when I'm an assassin. I don't have to proc it, I just put it on. <laughs> that would be great. But your fate should proc pretty freaking fast. I don't even put mine on because it procs so fast. I don't have any mana. I have 600 mana. So I'm, I'm, I'm running a little bit, then teleporting once, then running a little bit, then teleporting once. Constantly. Yeah, she's up here. Found her. Okay, so we're just going straight up here. Straight up here. This way, up here. There's a chopper. Rambo. She's Rambo. right in. She's right in this room right next to us here. Uh, you want to send me an invite, or y'all try to? Oh my god! It? Oh my god! <laughs> I love this shit. I swear to God. It proc for me. Hello. No. Furnace? Yeah. I've literally been thinking about making a... Um, Putting on metal grid and then making an iron golem out of an inside so I have like mana constantly. But I don't know if he's gonna stay alive or if he's gonna die every. Here, here, here. Right on the other side over here. You see him? He's like right in the corner. Hell yeah. It's clean now because we are like in agreements on how we're doing it. <laughs> I, yeah, well, I, I was unlucky on the last one. I fucking, when I got in there, I was already dead. <laughs> no, they nerfed that shit completely. It doesn't give you any experience like they did before. Right here, right here, right here. Just, they just get nuked, bro. They get absolutely destroyed. Hell yeah. You can do it outside town if you want. Okay, let me go in first. Let me go in first, then one at a time, right? Okay, then you go in first. You go in first and then go to the corner. And then wait. Yeah. Let me know when you're there. Okay. Hopefully I won't fucking die this time. Don't go in at the same time as me, right? 
Oh my god. What's he done? Where is Diablo? Right here. Oh okay, yeah. Now I'm on I'm Diablo. I'm not trying to. No, no, no Diablo is still here. Homie. Dude, last time I attempted this, I died so bad, like all the, like. 20 times. <laughs> yeah, I can't. Wh where is he? He's right there. Yeah, yeah, I could just couldn't. I couldn't see him for all the other enemies. Oh my god.